like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. It's not necessary for the fish to come out every time someone throws a fishing rod in water. Sometimes it could be an alien fish, exploding rivers, electrocuted fish, and many other things that no one was supposed to see. Fish with human face. Let's begin the video with a fish that turns itself into a human face when it senses danger. <laughs> Looks weird, right? The most jaw-dropping of all entries. This was a baby puffer fish who puffed as a defense mechanism when caught by a Russian fisherman at some unknown place. <laughs> Similarly, once a fish was spotted near the shore of a river and it legit has the face of a human. I mean, look at it. Isn't it just mind blowing? Electrofishing of Asian carps. And this clip is the reason why electrofishing is prohibited in the US. In seconds, the invasive school of Asian carp was electrocuted and then removed from the Barkley Dam, Kentucky. <laughs> Feeding frenzy of piranhas. You might have seen piranhas feeding, but one of their most epic frenzies was caught by this fisherman who lowered a cow head in the pond, and whoa, that was weirdly satisfying. <laughs> Exploding River. A couple living near a river witnessed and filmed an amazing phenomenon. The man was cleaning his boat after the rain, and whenever he threw a bucket of water back into the river, it exploded like mad. No one knows what that is, but my speculation says that it's some kind of fish like Piroruku or Piranha. What do you guys think? Fishing Bluefin Tuna. Who was supposed to see this level of commercial fishing if it was not captured on camera? So, the community is divided on whether fishing on such a huge level should be morally right or not. But the technique is amazing, and the skill of these fishermen are insane. Hundreds of bluefin tuna is caught and then stored in big containers. And the clip is truly epic. Fisherman catches mammoth skull. In 2009, a fisherman accidentally caught the skull of a mammoth. In the same area, after some years, a group of friends who were fishing there caught the tusk of a mammoth that weighed around 110 pounds. The archaeologists then went on to excavate the whole area, and there they found a full skeleton of an extinct mammoth. Isn't it simply incredible? Amazing fishing. The South Pacific Ocean is still relatively healthy and teeming with fish. In such conditions, there's an old-fashioned way to catch them which looks fun and efficient. The secret is to use the barbless hook, so when they sling the rod back, the fish goes flying off. Catching a shark barehanded. It begins with baiting the shark and then patiently waiting for it to get caught in the trap made by the tribe's men themselves. Once the shark is caught, the men just use their bare hands to load the shark onto a wooden kayak. That too, made in the tribe. I'm a bit worried seeing the rain pouring out the kayak in the video, but I'm sure the man must have mastered the technique of getting out of it too somehow. Amazing! And just to show you the difference, here is a man of culture trying to load his catch. Bottle hook fishing. Hands down to one of the most amazing techniques of catching fish that shows us how necessity is the mother of invention. These young lads are putting the bait for their catch in the plastic bottles and then place it at different places in the pond. After some hours, when the bottles start dancing weirdly, it means the trick has worked. The boys come back and pick up their catch. Flying Silver Carps. Who would have believed that if you catch fish, even without catching fish? I can explain. See, silver carps have infested these waters and they leap out of it and land wherever they like, on the face or in the boat. That's their call. Alien Fish. One of the most mind-boggling entries. I mean, what the hell is this thing? 
an unknown species, an alien fish, or a mutant case of genetics. This thing was fished out of a bay in New York City. And whoever saw this, whether online or in person, it freaked them all out. So, what do you think about this bizarre thing? Shark giving birth. The man of this entry went fishing and caught a shark. To his luck, the shark was about to give birth and he assisted it to deliver. Luckily, the baby sharks were fully developed and all of them swam right off. Biggest catfish ever. How big can this impressive fish be? Well, this fisherman caught a catfish and told the world that it could reach an impressive length of 2.5 meters and weigh around 280 pounds. The man struggled for three hours for this glorious catch. And well, we're glad he did. Otherwise, who would have believed the size of the fish this fisherman just caught? Fisherman catches a great white. While netting a school of fish, this fisherman accidentally caught a great white shark as a bycatch. What next? The crew put the shark back in the water and off it went. Whiskey bottle inside a fish. This clip is gonna show you why pollution is a real problem in the oceans. Though the start of the clip is a bit boring with the fisherman showing off his cutting skills. The climax comes seconds later after he dissects the stomach of the fish. There was an unopened bottle of whiskey inside the fish. Some people say that it was fake, but what do you guys think? Dry fishing. And now, no matter how unreal it may seem to you and me guys, dry fishing is real. During dry periods, the marine animals wrap themselves in a mucus cocoon, burrow into the mud, and lie dormant even for years. When water comes back, they pop up back in life, but fishermen go onto the dry lands to catch them. There's a skill to it too. The cracks where fish are lying dormant are slightly different from others. So yeah, finding the exact spot is a real talent that comes after years of experience. Fish giving birth. Yeah, giving birth is no big deal, but how many of you have seen a fish giving birth through its mouth after being caught? These fishermen had in their catch two fish who delivered their babies through their mouths. Watch it for yourself. And this is not delivering, but a defense mechanism. This is how the mother fish protects newly hatched fish from the other predators, by storing them in their mouth. Amazing! I loved it when the fishermen threw the fish back in the water. Snail eggs wash ashore. Thousands of orb-like creatures invaded and littered a beach in Argentina. And no matter how hard you try, you won't be able to crack it unless I tell you what it is. Well. Those were egg capsules of a species of sea snail that got washed ashore by the strong winds and high tide at Mar del Plata. And I'm glad that such a magnificent sight was caught on camera. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. The subscriber's pick. Today's subscriber pick is edited, but we're pretty sure that it refers to breaching, which is pretty common. So there's nothing really special to show you guys. Let us end our video here then. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.